Hello, this is Carl from Tista Sputnik and today I'm very excited to share with you the news that we have started the manufacturing of Apollo ones, especially the VP version. And today I wanted to share you how we designed Apollo one and where did we put emphasis on designing this unit that we see here. So. Uh, when designing this, we had to take into account the current global situation of components, so we will be easily able to switch out components and also be flexible during the manufacturing if uh, we need to change direction quite quickly. So the unit itself uh, has a main motherboard here, as you can see here. So this is just the PCB of that motherboard and you can see that the PCB has holes in it. The holes are in it because we chose to use uh, small power supplies that can be replaced actually. So this way if one of these power supplies is not available we can just switch over to another manufacturer and the power supply attaches here. Uh, and here's a version of this board where we already have place the components on the board and the last step that we do is we put the power supplies and here you can see that the power supplies go under the board here. So once we're done with this uh, then we have uh, basically this is the brain of the unit and then we have the front facing area or the LED board. So here's an LED for PCB, just an empty PCB and we made the background white to uh, cut down on color fringes or reflections if the light uh, reflects back. Uh, here is the same board now with already the LEDs on it um, and as you can see what we do is we have each LED rotated at a unique angle and this actually enables us to do two things. One is to have a very narrow beam angle and the other is that we can actually get really good color mixing. So once the LEDs are on the board uh, then this board goes actually onto this cooler which we have here. So we have the board already on the cooler. And then uh, when the board is on the cooler, we put this board inside an automated uh, robotic measuring machine, which then measures and places uh, each uh, lens exactly in the middle of each LED. And then it gets glued to the board using a UV curing system, kind of like when you're not the dentist. And after that, uh, all this gets assembled together. And this, the only thing that this is missing now is the back cover for the VP version. So we are on track to start shipping out the first units before the end of January, which we're very excited about. Uh, and then soon after that, we will start shipping out the regular ones. So thank you and until the next update.